in Nigeria on a daily basis witness the impunity which is a so-called Falani Hertzman extremist who share an ethnic and religious identity with President Buhari and the Falani elite, which now dominates all key institutions in Nigeria. To open an investigation specifically into the wide-scale and systematic killing of the civilian population and most notably targeting the indigenous people of Biafra. It's clear that now we've put uh, the Biafran issue on the radar screen uh, of the government, of the Biden administration, of Congress. Uh, ongoing and wide-scale systematic killing of the civilian population and again specifically targeting the IPOB. Of, of weapons being used against the Afrans but affirmatively supporting an effort to have a independence referendum organized and conducted by the United Nations as we've done in South Sudan. They formally open an investigation and look into what we are identifying as a genocide that's being committed by the Nigerian government and extremist Fulanis against the indigenous people of Biafra. Uh, there's been nothing in experience since 1960 to suggest there simply is not a way, uh, given the, the history of division between the Fulani and the Biafrans, to think that they can coexist under a single sovereign roof.